I'm in the gates. Can you see it? The little Disney World game. <laughs> and we're headed to Disney Springs. So this is gonna be the first time since everything happened. And we've taken a few steps very slowly. We've pretty much just been at home all year. Um, and we have, you know, very, you know, certain things that we need to be in place to feel like it's something we're willing to do. I feel okay trying this because the masks are enforced and, um, you know, there are social distancing markers and now that I have gone out a few times, um, we're gonna just give it a try and just see what it's like. If we don't like it, we can leave. So, first time going to Disney Springs. Let's see. All right, we're parked in line. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous because this whole temperature taking thing, it's my first time doing that. Um, I don't like to be close to anyone, obviously. <laughs> and at first they were wearing face shields, but now I don't think they are. And that makes me really uncomfortable to think that somebody would be that close to everyone and not be wearing a face shield, so. Okay, I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> I'm nervous. So this is the entrance over here, and we're about to figure out how this works. Probably won't record this part because I just want to focus on my life and living. Okay, slowly approaching, and I can see it's pretty spaced out, and... I, I get it now. I needed a minute to see what was happening. I feel a little better. I'm back, baby. You follow me on Instagram, you already know. <laughs> oh. I can try right now. Oh my gosh. It's huge. This is so huge for me. <laughs> oh man, I missed it. There are a lot of people here. But everything's really spread out. I'm back at Disney Springs. Whee! <laughs> this is your first visit to Disney Springs in six months. Yeah, it is. How do you feel? I feel hungry. <laughs> Off the nose when coughing and sneezing, and maintain physical distancing. Thank you for your cooperation. <laughs> I didn't think to show it because I was like way too excited to eat my hot dog, but we found a little tiny corner and we ate BB Wolves plant-based hot dog. I'm gonna put a picture in. <laughs> I am not quite ready to go in this store. I do miss it. I'm enjoying it from the outside. But I do like this selection of... Oh, look at these! Those are so cute! This jacket though. Okay, again, I'm not going inside, but so cute. Wait a second. Wait a second. So we were going to get cookie dough from the food truck, and it's not here. So we're going to go check out our old favorites, go about the scene, and see how Aaron McKenna's is doing. It's a small place, so I don't know. Your nose and mouth and be worn at all times except when actively eating or drinking while stationary. Wash your hands often and thoroughly. Cover your mouth and nose when coughing and sneezing and maintain physical distancing. Thank you for your cooperation. <laughs> I love him. Maybe next time. Too many people. Bummer. These are definitely still a novelty to me. Okay, so that was just too small of a space. Just because you start going out again doesn't mean you just do everything, right? Like, I'm definitely making sure that everything I do is reasonable for the current times. So, haven't really gone inside. We ate outside, we found a quiet corner with nobody uh, at it. It was actually really nice. It was like on the water over by the Lego store like right across from BB Wolves where we got the um, 
the plant-based hot dog from there was this little like alcove out on the water nobody was there so it was perfect and then we really just like walked around outside and it, it just made a world of difference like it was so nice to be here and to enjoy this beautiful place and eat some stuff and yeah just really exciting to enjoy Disney Springs again <laughs> I don't think I'll be eating out inside anywhere for a really long time but um, this is like a really big first step just to even like eat from the kiosks and stuff so it's very happy very happy about that it's just so beautiful I love it here we're probably gonna head out soon but there are some like outdoor kind of stores that you can just kind of like walk up to so there's this rustic cuff earlier I saw from a distance as we walked by some really sparkly things so we need to go investigate I mean look how pretty this is it just like soothes my rainbow loving soul Are these like elastic or do they? Some of them are. Some of them are um, stretchable so they can fit any size. So sparkly. I love it. These are really, really cute. Hi. Hi. I love this one. Oh, this one on the end is so pretty. We were having a discussion about fiddle leaf figs. Fiddle leaf fig. <laughs> we have a fiddle leaf fig tree at home and we were talking about whether they can be outside or not and Jim said, what'd you say? I said they can. <laughs> Why? Because, well, aside from it being a tree and a plant. Uh, but some that's... can't be in the sun. <laughs> but that uh, there are some here at Paddlefish that I remember that are the biggest fiddle leaf figs I've seen. They're really nice ones. Yeah. And so we like to do this thing when the other person was right. We like to slowly say, you were right. And just let that person have their moment. So Jim, you were right. There it is. That's the thing. It's doing well. It is surviving outside. It was so nice to just see this view again. Oh. I just want to be a mermaid and live in here. Can that be my life? We were looking for a vegan sweet treat that we could get outdoors. You're our only hope of all the things. Isn't this the most perfect thing to have in a pandemic? And yet, disappointment. One of my favorite things to eat at all of Disney Springs is so simple and basic. It is chips and guac from the Frontera Cochina to go window. I mean, I love sitting in here and eating too, but I always find myself just grabbing a quick lunch of chips and guac. We love this place when we ate everything. Now we love it as plant-based eaters. That was closed. No. <laughs> the best pandemic dining options are not working right now. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah. Like I'm literally trying to eat here. Man. Stairs longingly at his favorite store. I think we just hit prime time here at Disney Springs because we were gonna try Amaretts and off road and get something not vegan, but it wasn't meant to be because the line is pretty long and out the door. This was a really fun time. I'm super glad we came. We got to have some hot dog. Hot dog, sausage, bun, pretzel bun. <laughs> that was good. We got to see our friends for a while. Just so good to be here. So I guess that's it for today, but we'll be back soon. Maybe, would you be back soon? Yeah. I think I would like to come when there are a little bit less people here, but it still is manageable, especially on uh, the west side or just, uh, not over here by World of Disney. <laughs> so, still a great time. Just happy to be here. And uh, any last thoughts? 
It was it was nice. Earlier is uh, earlier is better. Yeah. Well, we'll see you next time.